Well, welcome back, you two, to your favorite channel. Am I right? Yes. I'm Phil. <laughs> I'm Sam. And we are Bars and Barbells. And we've done a few tries from Pucci Ariani. Yeah, she's amazing. She's great. And now we're doing the finals. It's a big one. Ooh. However, I do already know the outcome of what happened with Pucci. And unfortunately, she did not win. Really? Yes. That's so, so sad. So, well, we don't know how well she did. I mean, you know, yeah. she may not have Well, performed. I mean, also, like, some of the other performers were really good, too, so. That's also a possibility. So, anyways, yeah. I wanted to let you know about that before we got into it, and you're not, like, hoping, I hope she wins, and, yeah, and then she I just, win. you know, it was all over YouTube, right? You get them, I'm on YouTube, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> and so, um, I just saw it come up in terms of, like, videos recommended for mm, you. Poor Putri. And, uh, so I'm pretty sure I could be wrong, but I, that's what I saw, is that she did not win. But I don't care because i really love putri ariani she's yeah. such a i mean unfortunately there can only really be one winner right no matter how I much talent there is oh is there two i think i don't i'll clearly know nothing about america's got talent so <laughs> and it doesn't you know necessarily make or break right because um you can go on to have a great career mm. after the fact she's already been singing prior to this so yeah you know. well i mean not from this specific show but i'm pretty sure there are people from american idol that didn't win that ended up being just as famous or if not more successful yeah. than people who did win it's that season just a platform yeah it right? just gives you exposure so, I, we've loved her regardless yes, so Our, much you know She's so, so impressive sweet. such a great energy like yes. you said so sweet so i don't care um i get to see another pucci ariani performance and that's yes. what i'm excited for you as well i am i'll still all right Let's <laughs> All right. that, that did not go as it was supposed to, but we're ready. Let's go. <laughs> I just got too excited. <laughs> so pretty. Thank you! 
<laughs> I wonder if that was her mom there. It's so cute. She always at the end too. It's like thank you. I know. It's like still somewhat innocent, you know, childlike sound when she says it, yeah. but it's so far removed from what we just watched before that with oh, her I performance. Know. It doesn't sound like a kid at all and, and her uh, voice sounds so mature i feel like i mean i exactly. can't remember how old she is but it sounds very like developed i think she's 17 or 18 yeah so point. it sounds older than that for sure um yeah and uh you know i think she might have been a little bit nervous to start off with um well i would be too so finals well i think like it, that's the thing with her right when she really gets to singing she's so amazing like so good and um you know, she, I think this is an Elton John song. Is it? I, I think. Yeah, I don't know. Um, but she almost sounded like Whitney Houston the way she was singing it, mm-hmm. you know, which is a, obviously a huge compliment because Whitney Houston is next Incredible, level. Yeah. Right? Um, but it was so cool with the choir as well. And, yeah. Um, the background vocals. Were yeah. And so once she got, got into ripping on it, like after the first, like, you know, 10 seconds, just so so great so i mean i don't know what the other acts look like in the you know in the finals but yeah. i would be hard pressed to see how you could you know beat her story beat her performance you know was, like i said she did a great job once she yeah. got into the flow of it and even the stage looked really cool yeah. like her outfit was really pretty like yeah you know? i just really hope it wasn't like some lame you know I mean, I'm sure there's fans of the other people in the, in the, uh, in the competition and I'm, you know, not trying to hate on anybody because I haven't seen anything, but yeah. in years past, I know it's kind of been like, you know, person doing tricks with a dog or something like yeah, that that's wins. One. Yeah, yeah. And it's like, to me, I'm sorry, like what she's doing is exponentially more talent, but I guess it's people's preferences and, you know. Uh, who watches the show and all that stuff. But anyways, I've been rambling for a while. I love Putri doing her thing again. What did you think? I thought it was great. I thought she sounded awesome. Like you said, I mean, not that she sounded bad in the beginning, but I agree she sounded a little bit like toned down a little bit and maybe a little bit nervous. Reserved maybe a yeah. little bit more. But once she well, got maybe into on those... purpose as well. Sorry, continue. Yeah, once she got into those like higher notes and really get, like, getting into that range, I was like, wow, like just again, just such amazing talent. Yeah. I thought she looked beautiful. I thought the stage looked beautiful. The choir was really cool. And I, you know, I think it's crazy because I guess like this, I could be wrong, but this is a show where the fans pick the winner, right? Like, yeah, I think vote. you call in to vote. Yeah, so I mean like, you know, from a, a standpoint of... I guess like, you know, you have two different perspectives. Like if you let judges pick it, it's going to be more from a standpoint of like, you know, I guess talent per se only. Whereas when it's the fans, it's kind of just like who you like and your entertainment value and whatever. Right. So you never really know what you're going to get for a winner. Right. But I thought she did amazing. Yeah. I mean, you know, I think my perspective too on it is that like you were alluding to, it's kind of, you know, the pop popularity contest yes, in some circumstances. Exactly. But it's like, why wouldn't she be voting for her? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She's clearly talented. And on yeah. top of that, like, look at her backstory and what she's had to overcome. So, like, why wouldn't she be like, yeah, I want to support this person yep. as well as the talent, yeah. right? So that's just my perspective on it. But I guess yeah. as well, I don't know the other stories. Maybe there are more influential stories as well. Because, yeah. Well, you know, isn't... Um and Enrique Iglesias, he's in the same competition. Gabriel Henri. Oh, sorry, yes, Gabriel. <laughs> <laughs> Enrique Iglesias. <laughs> don't know what planet you were on. I don't know. Yes, <laughs> Gabriel Enrique. Um, too many names, but yeah. yeah, he's in the same competition, right? Yes, but he was eliminated in the last round. Oh, uh, okay. Because I was gonna he, say, like, to me, like his up. story was very inspiring, and he was very good. Great singer as, as well. well. But we only have done the music, anyways. Yeah. Um, let's continue and see what they say, and uh, we'll go from there. I'm in your golden buzzer! But, Terry, you know, it's got nothing to do, actually, with the fact that I gave her the golden buzzer. I think any one of us would have given Putri the golden buzzer. It's just that you are one of those rare little diamonds we come across every few years who is naturally born to do this, and you've overcome so much in your life to hopefully fulfill your dream on the on this show and boy after that do you deserve it thank you so much Howie, well every single time in every round you have hit it out of the park your voice as i said last time is perfection your talent is perfection i love your choices the, the, the question that i have if this was and i have no doubt in my mind if this was just a singing competition i think you just won it hands down the fact is 
there are other kinds of acts. You're competing a lot against a lot of great people, so let's see how America chooses. That was Heidi. It was such a moving performance. You could have not done it any better. You really, really did an amazing job. You sounded beautiful. Thank, Thank you, so, you much. so much. Putri, you just performed on the finals. What is the message you have to give to the world? Vote for me. I believe that we are able, we are capable, and we are equal. So <laughs> don't be afraid to keep reaching your dream. Our dream will come true if we believe it. <laughs> She's no so pitch cute. necessary to vote for me. <laughs> Love She's that so message cute. at the end too. Yeah, for sure. And you know, she could have used that as an opportunity to be like, "Vote for me," but she didn't. She tried to give like a positive, encouraging message to people. Right. That's one thing though that like how we said that's true. Like just kind of going back to what we were talking about before is that it is kind of hard to compare completely different types of acts in a level of you know talent and who should win. Like in a singing competition, I feel like she would have hands down won, no questions asked. But like when you're trying to compare different types of acts, it's like how do you even do that? It's like comparing apples to oranges. Yeah, and like you you know. You with music in particular people have a certain tastes that they enjoy or don't enjoy so yeah. you know she people may think she's great but just don't resonate with the type of music that she's singing or you know what she uh, you know how she's singing and that's why they don't vote for her and they really like other forms of entertainment so yeah that plays into it but i enjoyed it nonetheless she killed it you know she's uh, like i said a gem and this isn't going to define here clearly we'll be on the lookout maybe doing some more stuff from her in the future right yeah i'm really interested to see like where her career goes and you know where she goes from here and yeah. how she develops yeah i'm sure she's going to be releasing a bunch of stuff now that she's got her momentum going so yeah. i'll look forward to that hopefully you guys look forward to our reaction or you did enjoy our reaction, I should say. And you can look forward to more from us in the future by subscribing and hitting the notification bell. We got lots of content every single day, two videos. Um, you know, like we were just talking about different kinds of content yes. that people enjoy. We have lots of different types we have of content. Comedy, sports, and music. So yeah. lots of different stuff for you guys to enjoy too. Anyways, that's it from us. I hope you guys enjoyed Putri. We did. We'll be back soon with another one. Bye guys. Thanks for watching.